$20. St. Joseph Missions has learned directly from one of our single homeless sisters that the going rate for purchasing a woman's body and debasing it at will, if she is desperate enough for a hot meal and a warm bed for just one night, is $20. No woman should ever have to compromise her body or her spirit for food or a bed. This is just the beginning of the nightmare scenarios facing the 1,022 single women who, when calling in to United Way of Allen County's 211 helpline over the course of a year, identified themselves as homeless. The majority were ages 19 to 39, but the 60-plus age group has grown dramatically. Surprisingly, some of these women were employed part-time and even full-time, but were homeless for the first time. 1,022. We must do better. Our Allen County neighbors have always given so generously. It is no one's fault that this homeless population has been overlooked, but the stark reality is that single, unaccompanied women, especially those not currently suffering from addiction or domestic violence, have nowhere to go when a crisis arises. As a community, it is time for us to step up and right this injustice. Thus, St. Joseph Missions is addressing this urgent unmet need by creating the first 24-7, 365, emergency shelter specifically for single homeless women. In essence, we are trailblazers. And in an exhilarating update, we are proud to announce that we are home at last, having taken possession of 3505 Lake Avenue on July 31st. Renovations are underway to fulfill our dream. As designed, our women's shelter will go beyond offering 18 beds to potentially serve 130 guests annually as a refuge from the bitter elements and the violence of sexual predators and sex traffickers. We will be a shelter with accountability and purpose. We will offer our homeless sisters a path to hope and self-reliance. We will earn trust by honoring all guests with the dignity and respect they deserve. We will connect qualifying candidates to existing programs that address their underlying causes for homelessness. Many of our community partners are either neighbors or available at the bus hut two doors down. We will empower our guests through increased responsibility for the welfare of their peers and the collective shelter community. Grace through service is a gift we should all experience. Naturally, one fundamental question always arises. Have we checked with the homeless community to ensure we are on target? We now have two young women on our board, Melissa and Cynthia, who have overcome unimaginable abuse and homelessness and courageously serve as our North Stars. Melissa and Cynthia are using their newfound voices to advocate for their single sisters suffering in silence. So, how can you help care for our guests? We have secured nearly all of our renovation costs, so your generous support would be used to purchase beds. Exceptionally high-quality mattresses have been donated, and volunteers are sewing quilts for our guests to use at the shelter and take with them when they leave. Just as it is for all of you, Peaceful, restorative slumber is essential to our guests' physical, mental, and spiritual health. With you standing alongside us, St. Joseph Missions will open our doors and bring our vision to fruition in March of 2021 so we can welcome our single sisters home. They then can fulfill their glorious potential, and hopefully no woman will ever again have to give herself a $20 price tag.